Hello, Forever Family. Until then, keep focus on what matters most to you. Hello, Forever Family, and welcome to another episode of Forever Matters. I'm Nick Woodward Shaw, and I'll be your host for this episode. We've just come back from another incredible EMR event in Pattaya, Thailand, and the energy in our markets is skyrocketing. Let's take a look at just some of the excitement happening around the world. In September, Romania had their annual managers meeting with more than 200 leaders present. This event was filled with lots of motivational and business training and lots and lots of fun. The next day, they held a success day with more than 1,000 attendees to build inspiration in their market and celebrate FBO achievements from this summer. Then in Tanzania, they held a success day with more than 500 FBOs to recognize new managers and 20 of their FBOs were then headed off to the Eagle Managers Retreat. And next, making our way east to India, September was filled with more local events to celebrate their leadership and inspire and motivate all those who attended. One event was a month-long training festival wow, with objectives to increase business development, share best practices and identify the best trainers. More than 6,800 FBOs participated in person at all the trainings held with a total of 97 trainers, with thousands more attending online. India, we're going to be watching you in the next few months to see how these events have made an impact in your area. Well done. As I mentioned at the beginning, we've all just returned from another exciting EMR event. We were at the beautiful Royal Cliff Resort in Pattaya. And as you can see, we had the most incredible time. The fun and networking we had in Thailand was amazing. And at the trainings, we learned, we celebrated, we laughed, we danced, and we cried at what we experienced from the stage. We immersed ourselves in the local culture, visiting floating markets and breathtaking temples, and also took some time to give back to those less fortunate. But more about that later. Our last night Eagle Manager parties have become legendary and this one did not disappoint as we danced the night away with one of the best DJs in the world, our friend DJ April. So make sure you make it a key goal of yours to qualify as an Eagle Manager next year. We want you to join us as we rock the boat on the cruise through Italy and Croatia. Now, unless you've tuned out from all outside communications, you must have heard about our latest exciting product launch. It's the Nourishing Hair Oil, and this latest product is an incredible addition to all our hair care products, aloe jojoba shampoo and conditioner. Now our hair oil is formulated with six silicon-free botanical oils that provides moisture, shine, and frizz control. It's a lightweight oil, so it won't weigh your hair down, and it smells incredible. I've been using it every day on my crazy hair and beard, and I thoroughly recommend it. It's amazing and smells awesome. And now it's time for my favorite part of Forever Matters, recognition of all you guys. I'd first like to call special attention to all our FBOs from around the world who've been working so hard to qualify for Level Up. So far, we have six FBOs that have guaranteed their spot to join us in the Dominican Republic in March, 2024. So congratulations to Alisi and Chelenisi from Moldova, to Joanna Casimirez from Poland, to Ilaria Masiello from Italy, also from Italy, Rosalia Aiello, Binish Abubakar from the UAE, and to Sahrish Ahmad from the UAE. Now there are only a few months left to qualify, so keep working hard now through to the end of the year so that you can level up your business and join us in the Dominican Republic. Now next, I'd like to recognize a few of our SBOs from around the world who've recently advanced to Sapphire Manager. Dimitar Mehenziski from Bulgaria, Tarang Aurora from India, and last but not least, Mame Bioso and Alio Ben E. Diop from Senegal. Congratulations for reaching this major milestone in building your forever business towards more future success. We also have two brand new diamond managers. Congratulations to Binish Abubakar from the UAE, 
Beanish has achieved so much in just five years with Forever, qualifying for Chairman's Bonus four times, the Forever Global Rally five times, Level 3 in Forever to Drive, Eagle Manager four times, and much, much more. She stayed in the top five FBOs for the past few years in her region and is now reached Diamond Manager. Thank you, Beanish, for continuing to motivate and build such a strong team. Over in Japan, we'd like to congratulate new Diamond Manager, Sei Moriwaki. Congratulations, Sei. She's become FBO in 2009 and has been with Forever for 14 years now. She became a Diamond Sapphire Manager in August of 2020 and now has reached her goal of Diamond Manager. But she's not stopping there and is already working on her next goal and we are gonna be watching to make sure you get there. Now it's time to recognize our top 10 FBOs globally for September who had the most global case credits. In 10th position, Miho Sugihara from Japan. In 9, Attila Girafalvi from Kazakhstan. Congratulations at number 8 from Moldova, it's Marina Karnat. Number 7, Joël Bonafoy Poli from France. Number 6, great job to Krishna Aurora from India. And number five from the UAE, Beanish Abu Bakar. Number four is Deheya Ahmad Atea from Turkey. Number three from Japan, Etsuko Mototsuji. In number two position is Rolf Kip from the UAE. And in number one spot from Japan, congratulations to Hanami Takagi. And now let's recognize our top 10 open group for September. In 10th position from Iraq is Hussein Fadhil Hamid. Number nine, from Morocco, Kautar Taiju. Number eight, congratulations to Yuko Fujiata from Japan. And number seven from the UAE is Binish Abu Bakar. Number six, congratulations to Maria Fabiola Casto from Italy. And number five, from Iraq, Suha Mohamed Idan. Number four is Misaki Kato from Japan. And in number three position, congratulations from Turkey, Deheya Ahmad Atiyah. Number two are from Moldova, Marina Karnat. And number one, once again, congratulations, Hanami Takagi from Japan. One of the highlights at our EMR event was collecting and giving stuffed toys to children of the Father Ray Foundation. Thanks to all of those who donated, we collected more than 400 toys. Plus, many hygiene and food items were collected to support the children's village and daycare needs. We extended a special invitation to FBOs at EMR who made donations to the Forever Giving Foundation in the past to deliver the collected donations directly to the children of the Father Ray Foundation. Now first we took our guests to the daycare center and delivered some of those toys and learned about the history of this incredible foundation. Then we headed over to the children's village to deliver more toys to about 155 children and watch an entertaining presentation that they prepared for us. This moment with the children was one that we truly will never forget. Thank you so much for your hospitality, Father Ray. And that brings us to a close in this episode of Forever Matters. Be sure to tune in next time to hear the latest recognition and news from around the forever world. And until then, remember, stay focused on what matters most to you.